Is um so I honestly didn't think I was gonna get a video in this week, but I am because um uh oh I can because I'm not at school. Um sorry. Uh, there's TV going in my background. Pink eyeshadow would be so angry. Um. Okay, sorry. So the reason that I can um do the video is because my car broke down again last night, and I couldn't go to school. I also had an eight-page paper due today. I was finishing it up at 1.30 last night, and somehow, half of it got deleted. I don't know how. I have an autosave that saves every minute. Um, I'm guessing what happened was, somehow, I must have hit something and deleted part of it, and then it saved, so there's not an older copy to go back to. I'm guessing. I don't know. Um... But anyway, let's get to the numbers, and then I'll actually talk about stuff. Uh, last week, I was 209.8, and um, this week, I've seen, like, 211, 212. Um, yeah, but today, I weighed, and I was 209.2, so that would mean I lost a total of 0.6 pounds, which... It's not very good, but actually it is because I've been eating like shit, and there's no excuse, honestly. Like, I've been stress eating, and I feel like everything's falling apart, and I've been freaking out, so I don't know what's going to happen. I basically have quit my Thursday job because... Um, I feel like it's not fair to them that I keep having car issues and then I have to do stuff for school. And so I have to cancel a lot. So basically I said, you know, I can't do it anymore. Because they talked to me about it last week. And then I was like, oh no. I don't have anything going on the rest of like the month or anything coming up on a Thursday where I would have to miss work. And then my car breaks down again. And... So it's just frustrating, I guess. And then school's just... Ugh. Anyway, I don't know how Snowy White 79 does it. Homeschooling her daughter and going to school herself and working full-time. It's stressful. Um, yeah. So, let's see. I honestly don't have anything to tell you, really. My trainer is happy with my progress, but he won't let me take measurements because he says, like, I don't know. He won't let me do measurements. He's already done measurements, but he won't retake them, he said, because he doesn't want me to be discouraged if it's not, like, big enough numbers. But I don't feel like I would be discouraged. I just really want to know, which I know I could do them at home, but I don't have the original numbers or anything, so I don't really have anything to go off of. And, um, I'm, if he doesn't want me to, then I'm not going to. Um, I can tell, obviously, things are fitting differently. Um, I really need to get my scrub shirts in. I was supposed to do that last night, and I didn't. Uh, yeah. So, honestly, like, I've been eating, like, absolute shit, so the, f sorry if that offends anyone. I've been eating really bad, and if, um, to lose 0.6 pounds is still better than nothing because, yeah, it's been pretty awful. Um, <laughs> I honestly, even when I'm, like, even when I go out to eat somewhere, I try and be protein conscious. But I've also ate things this week that were just, like, filler food that um, I shouldn't have been eating. In place... Instead of eating carbs or, I mean, instead of eating protein. So, um, I really, I don't have an excuse. Um, I did go to the gym this week. Um, 
um, both days that I was scheduled, even though I got there late yesterday because my car overheated and then I was in traffic for like literally a drive that should have taken me the point where my car overheated to the gym should have taken me maybe a half hour it took me a whole, an hour to get not even, like 10 miles maybe 12 it was ridiculous so yeah and we just got this problem fixed on my car which is really frustrating it was just in the dealership like maybe three to four weeks ago and this is the fourth time it's been in for overheating like recently so I don't know it feels like they're not really getting to the root of the problem but I don't know they said that it has to be it's probably a different problem because it worked fine for two or three weeks so I don't know it's frustrating um yeah, I don't have anything really to tell you guys. That's pretty much it. So I will talk to you later. I hope you're having good weeks. And I hope you're making better choices than I am. I'm going to try to make better choices because I feel like I'm so close to getting in the 100. <laughs> I only have 10 pounds and I could do that. It's just like I'm sabotaging myself. So, I need to really recommit and refocus, even though things are hard right now. Eating my feelings is not going to help anything, because that's what got me in this situation in the first place. Um, so, I mean, I just need to get back to basics, and obviously I know how to do that, and I just need to actually do it. So, yeah. I hope you guys are having a great week. Bye.